your old buddy Michael Chip here playing Run 8 Train Simulator 3. And this is the A Line Episode 60. Again. I say again because I just started recording like maybe five, six minutes ago. And then as I'm going on doing my thing, right, I look over and the recording stopped. I must have hit the wrong key uh, somewhere along the line. I don't know what wrong key it was, but it was. Okay, so there is a train. We're here at the uh, Taft TOFC, right? Uh, and uh, there's a train kind of in our way right now. Can you see it going by there? Let, let's let's run over there. Let's. Uh, uh, oh, he just left. He's no longer on our way. Once he gets down this way, he's no longer on our way. Uh, what we're doing here is we are working um, with train A775. Uh, I'm going to bring up the uh, switch list. Uh, right here, yeah. You see uh, A775. It works the Taft. Uh, and we have to take all these empty well cars you can see here that have all been emptied uh, at the Taft TOFC, which you can see is right here. It's in, in four cuts. I got one cut here. Here's a second cut. Cut three, cut four. What I'm going to do is once I uh, latch on to all or lash on to all of them, I'm going to run down this track right here as far down as I can get, which is why I got to have this train out of my way. Uh, and then we're going to back it back down this way. And we're going to put it into the Taft yard. Uh, so that way, the next time, whoever's going up to uh, Jacksonville Duval ramp can take that with you. We did. We made that run once already, and we may have to make it. We're going to have to make it again. But that's kind of like the nature of trains, right? Uh, so here we are with our train. And let me go like this. And I believe I have it tagged as... I. I do, right here. <laughs> I already knew it was tagged, and I thought it was going to show up at the top here. That That's our unit number, uh, and it's A775. Oakley dokley. So, the first thing we got to do is we got to drive along this track till we get past the switch so we can then back down this track and grab onto these uh, empties right here. So, let's do that first. Here we go. All right. I already have it in forward because I was actually driving the train before you guys showed up. There we go. It's down. It's down. Get that one off there. There we go. Put it in notch one. I hear the cycle up. Kill the bell. There we go. We're on our way. Very good. All right. What I was saying before I glanced over and noticed I was no longer recording was that I think I, I, update, I updated. I downloaded an update a little while ago. And these look new to me. I can't remember, though. I don't remember two of them being parked right there before. The cranes are all here. I, I don't I don't know. Not that it makes any big difference. All right. We are moving along here. Why is the brake cylinder filling back up? Here you go. Here you go. Stop doing that. Keep the brakes at zero, please. I'm noticing that we're going a lot faster this time than we were last time. I wonder if I just didn't notice that I had to bleed the brakes. I had to bail them. Something. All right. We're going to limit ourselves to 15 mile an hour. Going through here. There it is. 15. Notch one seems to get us there, so that's nice. This switch should already be set. I think that, yeah, it's normal. Yeah. It's normal. That's why it's green. And normal means straight. I want to put it in reverse once we pass this. Now, the next question is, are, how are the rest of these switches? I don't know the answer to that. But that's what they're paying me for, right? Figure that stuff out. And we have a crossing up here as well. It looks like normal... Normal, normal. This looks like it's normal. Then I don't know what it is around the corner there. We're going to have to take a look-see. Alrighty. Pat. Don't make me pet you, because I will. That's loud. Hey, folks. All right. Now, what 
What's this at? This should probably be wrong, right? Because another train just went over it. And these are not CTC switches. So we're going to hit the brakes. Uh, yeah, I think that one's wrong. Let's jump off here. Uh, there we go. That's probably what I did. I got to hit F12 to jump off. I'll bet you I hit F10 accidentally. Let's see now. How, how This one is reversed. Yeah, and it should be normal. Okay. There we go. And now what we're going to do is we're going to run over here. Check this out too because this is a CTC switch. Now this one is set correctly. Say what? Yeah, it is set correctly, isn't it? Yeah. Then we'll have to switch it back. Uh, let's take a look at... Uh, there we are. There. That's where we are. See, the flashing purple tells you where you are. So here we are right here. Uh, and when he comes out, he's going to go across. Or straight, actually, right now, right? I think that these two are on the, the CTC, and this CTC is on the same switch. Uh, so we have to pull up, eventually pull up past there. But right now, we do not. Now we're going to run all the way back. We're not going to have to drive that far on this when we're doubling up here. Hey, how you folks doing? Uh, Highway Patrol, you guys all right over here? How you doing, huh? Can I get you anything? Want me to wash your windshield? No? Okay. Uh, come back over here now. I'm sure the customers are always happy. Here we go. This is what we want to do. Let's get the brakes off. Uh oh. Why does that keep popping up? It happened on my last series, too. Something about some kind of site was blocked. Thank you, Norton. Probably have a virus the size. I don't know what. Uh, here we go. Put it in. Nope. Just notch one is going to be good. There we are. Now we just got to wait for this last car to uh, clear that. Uh, Clear this switch here, then we'll back up and go get those. We got to go down this track to get the other two. And the switch for that is just right down over there. It's not that much further away. All righty. I'm going to come over to Sponge and clean these up. They're looking awfully dirty. Right, let's do some coasting. There we go. And just because it's fun, we're going to back up now and really piss those people off at the, uh, <laughs> at the level crossing. Oh, no, it, it slowed down too early. Come on. Put it back in notch one we go slow down awful fast probably because we're on a we're on a curve yeah got a little flange flange problem there flange friction all righty half so he got his half a car and that'll do Right there. We're on a little break. Throw that. Come over here. Say, I'll grab onto you. Can't do it. One of those non-grab situations. Oh, hey, look at this one. I'll grab onto you. Oh, look at that. It'll let me grab onto that one. Okay, now we're going to back it up. There we go. Throw it in notch one. There it is. TMU train too long for available track. Extra cars ignored. Yeah, that's been happening. Uh, notch two. Why? Why are we not moving now? Is that whole thing happening again with F seven? No, it's backing up now. Okay. 
got to be patient, that's all. All right, so we'll ride this back down in now. Probably clear that uh, intersection. And we got a, we got a line up here. Look at this. <laughs> Poor people. I don't know why it's saying that the uh, too long for available track. Is it, why is it spawning cars? I, I'm under the suspicion. I may have said this last time too that. The, the, the database that I have is not really compatible with this version of the uh, A-line I have. And therefore, it's trying to spawn trains where it normally wouldn't. I don't know. I got to look up my, my files. I got lots. To, I still got a lot of trains to work with here. So if something is wrong, I still could fix it. No problem. I know you means unit. So that's a coal train? I'm not I'm not sure. Could be an intermodal, although I think they use I for those. I didn't think so on this route. But this is not the most updated. Uh, you know, this is like from, I, I keep hearing like it's from late 90s, early 2000s or 210s or somewhere in that range. All right, so we're humming along here now. This is too far away. I'm too Rail drivers a little bit closer. Rail driver's cool, but it's so big and bulky, it's hard to find a spot. But I manage. I need to get Mega Desk like uh, Dwight from uh, the office. down pretty quickly. The brakes are on or something. And then I'll jump off and we'll walk down here. We'll do a little run. Get some good exercise in. Now we're going to pick these up. Okay, give it a little throttle. Here he comes. Here he comes. <laughs> you know, railroading isn't always nonstop action. You know that, right? And if you don't, well, this just may not be the channel for you. Okay. Now, I'm wondering, are there any other switches beyond that CTC switch that I have to worry about? We'll fly over there and find out a little bit. Okay, that's going to be good right there. How fast it's slowing down? Why is it slowing down so fast? Is something on that? Hey, look at that. We're not even going to make it. Normally, we'd be able to slide right into that. What? Okay, well, give it a little bit more gas there, uh, smiling Jim. Let's uh, let's get this into uh, get this into gear. Okay, there we go. Now let's do the old. Uh, am I still recording? Okay, I am. Yeah, F five, F seven. There we go. All right. So now, before we uh, move forward, let's, uh, again, let's go check the situation here. So we come over here. This switch is already set correctly. Yep. Right. Yep. Uh, and then we come down here. And then this CTC is set correctly. Uh, or is it? Yeah, it is, right? Hug onto that rail right there. Uh, so let's go to F3 again and take a look at the situation. Yeah, so he'll go straight. And there's another one way down here. 
But that one is also set correctly. Uh, how far down is it? We're we talking a long ways. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, wait. It's way down there. Okay, that should be more than enough room to get my one train on here. Okay, just making sure that we don't make a mistake. Oh, we shot under the... I made a mistake. Okay, there we go. All right, now we're going to pull it forward. Put it in forward. There we go. And give me some. Cycling upwards. There he goes. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to run back to the back of the train and hang on to that. See if I can get back to it before it gets to five mile an hour. My guess is no. Look how fast it's speeding up. Oh, look out. Don't ram yourself into the back of these uh, trailers. Okay, so we're going to have him ease up on the throttle here just so I can grab onto this last one at under five miles. That seems reasonable. If I can grab onto this last one. That's the other, that's the other problem. This one's clean. Somebody came out with a sponge, like I said. All right. Let's see if I can grab onto it. There we go. Okay. Wagon's hoe. Right underneath the big boom here, huh? The uh, number sticking off of it. Slightly. Not quite glued with it. It's just these numbers right here. This side looks like it is. The other side looked like it was not quite painted all the way on. It was like hovering above it. That's RTG 9040. Do they have different numbers? No, that uh, has the same. That makes sense. Why would you go through the problem modeling? That says T0408, right? T048. Yeah, it's the same. Model. Which is fine. It, that's a, it doesn't bother me. In fact, it's really quite anal of me to even check on it. Let's put it into notch two now. Here we go. And so here are the other cuts we need to get. You actually can't see them. They're in there. They're in behind all these trucks. You can see one right there. There's a there's a lead end right there, I think. Now, Smiling Jim uh, is going to take care of blowing the horn across the thing. I'm actually blowing the horn right now. I, I can't. Well, well, he's got it. Which is to say that he's actually not doing it. Eh, he won't do it automatically for me. But, you know, again, I'm only one man. I would not be if... I mean, they do have now they have remote control on them. Uh, but there's no way that that... Uh, I would be riding all the way back here with remote control and across it. The crossroads, you see the flashing signals. There you go, that's a cool shot. Oh, good, my threats are blocked. Norton, stop it. I'm trying to be a YouTuber. Why do you keep telling me that? My last video did the same thing, and you know, I never restarted my computer. I should have restarted it. Oh, what an oversight. Okay. Ooh, all these JB hunts here. I don't remember all those being there before. This is all new. Well, parts of it are new. Look, there's the office. I got good coffee. There's a vending machine. You know what I could use right now is like a Snicker bar. Go along with my Coca Cola. I'm on a diet, though. So should. Ah, nobody's looking. Just saw my doctor. I won't see him for a few months. He'll never know. Half a year, actually. 
Why am I going out about this? I don't know. Okay, here we come. There's the track we need to go on to. Let's uh, slip it into neutral. Let's give us a little bit of break here. We've got another line up here of cars. Be a busy road. That one goes off to... Uh, there's another facility over that way. That's why we're not servicing right now. Okay, and we will hop off here. And we'll throw this from normal into reversed. We will hop back on, and now we're going to back up. Now I can't hear the horn. Put it in reverse. No, not two. Just give me one. Do it gently. There we go. And uh, now the F7 thing isn't happening. Well, now it appears to be acting weird. <laughs> Slowing down. I, I don't know. Half the time. I can barely operate this sim. It's fun, though. I love it. <laughs> Mastery of the skills is part of the fun. And I may not have mastered them yet. Now, it doesn't matter what this one is set at right here. That's the next switch we're going to be going over that splits us off into the two tracks because we have cuts on both. So it doesn't matter which one we go to. Now we're backing up again. These people are just got to love us. Right? Doing pretty good now. Let's put it in notch two so we can get to 15 mile an hour quicker. And it's a perfect time to... That is good. Oh, that gets the juices flowing. Alrighty. Well, this time, I'm not going to be quite as conservative. Of course, that's usually when things go wrong, but... Now, what are you going to do? Yeah, the other facilities over there... I forget what it is. Oh, I, I remember now. It's a... Uh, we'll take a look at it in a little bit, but we'll fly over there. Once we hook up here, uh, I think it's a auto rack place, a uh, car manufacturer or distributor, one or the other. We're either dropping them off or picking them up there. I can't remember. That's also part of A77's A route. Uh, and it's only uh, these two industries. That's it. That's all it works. Ready? Trucks with the weird cabs on them because they are uh, driving around these switchers. And look at that. They're all like all off to one side. Cabbies. All right, where are we at here now? There they are. I see them. There's the one cut, there's the other. Take it down zero. Notch, notch zero. And we're also going to take down the speed down to zero. Eventually. We're going to have to use a little brake this time. It's not slowing down quite as quickly. I would like it to. I'm trying to get a little bit worried. Oh, you're good, you're good. There you go. You don't, want to, you don't want to be hanging on to the train when it makes contact. He's got to slow down enough so I can get off and then come over here and hook things up for him. Okay. All righty. So let's back it up now. So we can hook up. Here he comes. You can't hook this up manually. You can't do it. I mean, you're going to hit, so it'll grab onto the car for you. There we go. Uh, so you can't come in here and... Because I'm hitting the wrong keys. Did I just turn off recording? No. I'm paranoid. Oh, we got some... Three-point three point safety, or 
three point check or something like that. See, the angle cock is closed. Uh, so we can uh, connect the air hoses. There we go. And then we can uh, open the angle cock. And then we come over here and we can. Uh, angle cock's open here automatically. Okay. I think that's the new thing they added on there, too. All right. Now it just takes a while for it to charge. But now we will just cheat and go boom, it's charged. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to walk in between the cars back here. Get to the end of this cut so we can grab onto this cut. This is one long train. All right, back we go. I grab the longer of the two cuts. Not that it makes a difference, I don't suppose. Okay, I'm on. Move forward. Bail the brakes. I see you're at six. Don't try to get up to six. I think I'm not going to notice like I usually do. Okay, we're moving. He's back. He's rolling backwards now. No, we're not moving. Okay, let's put it in notch two. A little more weight, maybe. Is that what the problem is? Maybe the, uh, no, no. Here we go. He's got something going now. Are the brakes on? Oh, yeah, I think the brakes were on. <laughs> yeah, that's what it was. All the car's brakes were on. Of course they were. They're all standing still. You got to release the brakes, you mo. That may be why we were uh, going so sl slowing down so fast on the other ones. Because the, the brakes were on. <laughs> oh, man. It's funny. You got to remember that stuff. Yeah. yeah, the brakes are on. In trains, the other, the other railroad game that I love to play... Uh, you don't have to worry about that. The brakes are automatically released. But here you got to worry about it. So, yeah, that's probably why it was slowing down so fast was because the hand brakes were on. Too many brakes in this game. you got the hand brake and the independent brake and the auto brake and the dynamic brake. Give me a brake. No, no, don't give me a brake. Give me, give me fewer brakes. Okay, here we go now. So we got one more cut. We're tripling up. All right, because we doubled up, we tripled up. And actually, we're quadrupling up, are we not? This is a cool shot. It's this, it's this kind of thing that makes you feel like a real railroader. I mean, I suppose I could go get a job at a railroad, experience it in real life, but you know what? Kind of old for that. Don't think they'd take me. So this is it. This is as close as I'm going to probably get to it until they come up with something new. Maybe virtual reality. I know that's on uh, D-Rail Valley. Toying with the idea of going virtual, but uh, having those things on the front of your face. It's really cool, don't get me wrong, but it seems uncomfortable. I have some people told me who bought them say, well, you really can't wear them more for like than half an hour. <laughs> really? Because when I sit down in front of the computer and I get myself a Coke, I can be here for hour after hour after hour. When I'm uploading to YouTube is usually when I am, you know, doing house chores or going shopping, grocery shopping or all those other things, you know, you got to do if you feel like eating and not living like a slob. Where's that switch at up here now? Got it set to slow speed, so I don't have to worry about my speed. Eventually, we're going to have to ask for mainline service. Our mainline authority. From auto, so we can throw those switches. Or I could just throw the switches. Pretty much tell auto to get bent. All right. I'll see if I put it in neutral now. Exploring when I would normally put it in the neutral. Yeah, now look at it. Now it's hanging up there. That's all it was. The handbrakes were on. <laughs> that makes me laugh.
All right, let's apply a little auto brake this time. gets down to five before I throw my body off of here. There we go. Now we're just going to come back here and we're going to say get some. Somebody went past the defect detector. Mile marker 670.2. Nice. Now we'll uh, put it into reverse. There we go. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Come on, bail. There it goes. Took a little bit. Now we're going to back out. Can we hear the horn? Yes, I can. Just barely, but I could hear it. You guys probably could, too. I'm noticing that when I do these videos, you guys usually can hear what I can hear. Now we're backing up. Are people waiting at the crossing, of course? Okay, we're going to put it in notch two. Notch one's not getting the job done. Nope, notch two isn't moving us either. The coupler pounds are changing. Notch three. They get locked up again. There's something something's not right. There we go. Let's try this and this. Hey, look at it. The brakes were back on again. What? Why are the brakes going on automatically? The hand brakes. Okay, here we go now. Now we got some action. Minus three, minus two. I can hear it coming. It's banging its way down the line. There we go. Notch two. Now we still got a little brake pressure on there. Let's get rid of that. There we go. Okay. I did throw the switch. Yep, we're going to go to the right this time. All right, let's go go back and get this last cut. This is taking quite some time to get this done, but again, that's what it's all about. Oh, we didn't look over and look at that facility. What am I, crazy? We'll look at it when I connect up here. I know I said that in the last one, but this time I really need it. See it yet? Not still around the corner there. Hanjin. That sounds. For some reason that sounds Chinese to me. Oh, I forgot I was looking for this. Oh, it's in between the two lines of. Uh, Trailers, so I'll have to Here we go. Auto is engaged, right? Need to go. And let's throw it in the neutral now. Give it a little auto brake. Give it a little indie brake. Nice. Okay. Slow down a little bit faster. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. I should I should have had that panic moment and I, it would have looked like yep right where I wanted it perfect it would have seemed more believable anyway okay let's uh back it up now a little bit more you've almost you're almost there yep 
He's moving them. And it goes back to zero. He was moving them. Something's moving up there. What the? How about that? There we go. And another F7 thing's happening. Again. Whoa. Look out. Okay. So we're going to go F5, F7. Go back here. To the end of this one, and then we'll ride this one out all the way past that CTC switch. Alrighty, can I grab on? Nope. This one's a no grabber. Does it make a difference if I come from the other side? Nope. It says no, not gonna happen, Chief. All right, so we'll go up to this one. Here we go. Yep. Forward. Throw it into forward. And give me notch one. There we go. I still have point one. We are moving now. Slowly, but we are moving. The F5, F7 thing, and we do pick up speed. Okay. I got to look see if there's some setting that's causing that to happen. I will throw it in match two. Where it's reluctant to move until I hit F7 again. Like, like it's as if the airlines bled out or something. Okay, let's see what's going on here. All right, so there we are there. We're coming up on this switch right here. But it's okay if we go on it because <clears throat> there's another train coming this way. N181. A run 8 on the front of it. You got a BNSF up here. And we got a uh, CSX right there. Cat's getting into something like it. Here, banging around in there. All right, here we go. Here we continue, I should say. <laughs> now she just walked out of the kitchen with her tail all puffy. She did something to scare herself. Or there's a raccoon running around in the kitchen. I'm not sure. Hoping it's option A. Alrighty. Let's take a look at this again. Are we running out onto the... No, we're still here. We're not running down he here yet. Now, that other train that's coming, he's a ways out, though. He's just, he's back here. He didn't even hit Winter Park Amtrak. Orlando. He should, he should be good getting out of his way. Not that I'm worried. I'm the CEO of this company, so. You'll just have to wait. This time we're going to go all the way through the uh, level crossing. Then we're going to ride it all the way down. Actually, we're going to go through two level crossings. Then we'll uh, ride it down until uh, we get past that CTC switch. We didn't look at that facility. 
That's twice I've lied to you now. That's sad. Of course, you don't like the fact that I do so much lying on this channel. Well, this just may not be the channel for you. Look at that. I said it twice now. And uh, that covers me for the next video. You could pay it forward. All right. We're going to get another real good look at this level crossing. And then also the next level crossing. It's so involved in what I'm doing, I forget what I what I said but moments ago. As far as going to check in this other facility. Alright, folks, this is the last time I'm gonna come across this one for a while, so you're free to go. Sorry for the inconvenience. What do we? What else? <clears throat> Get to go to Seven Eleven down there. Gotta have a vending machine. Or that probably have a lot of candy bars. All right, now we look at this. Still not down onto it yet. Run eight's coming up. I wonder if we're gonna have to wait for that guy. He's coming up faster than I thought he was gonna. We'll be able to see the switch on the other side here. With that one, yeah, there's the CTC switch right there. So let's throw it into neutral. And let's start applying some brake here. Possibly, except not possibly, yes. Okay, let's put it back in notch one. Move up a little bit, and then we'll see if I can't uh, throw this switch. Well, there you go. Now we're on the main, so is he going to stop him? I don't know. Still seems like he's quite a ways away. It's hard to tell. They're not to scale. Those blocks are not to scale, so you can never tell exactly how close they are. We'll see. Okay, and that'll be good right there. Stop it. And now let's do this. And we'll say, give me this. Give me this. Click that. Why won't that one go? That one won't go. Oh, there it goes. Was I just... Oh, maybe the, the train was too close to it? Could be. Okay, so now, now we should be set up, right? Yeah, so we're going to come down this way, right? Oh, yeah, see, it, it, the train was too close to it. Okay, so we're going to come down this way. Once we get it into the yard, we'll be out of the way of, of the run eight. Uh, train coming the other direction. Okay, can I get on this one? Nope, still can't. Okay. So let's go over. Let's get onto this side. Uh, I, I know I just walked right through it. Pretend you didn't see that. All right, so let's back this up now. Uh, throw it in reverse. Notch one, and I might as well just hit F7 right now. Beat it. There we go. Oh, we got to take the brake off. Don't forget the brake. You're not going to get very far with the brakes on. There we go. What the? There we go. <laughs> there we are. All righty. All 
Back it up. Did I leave control? Yeah, I still have control of these switches here. Can I make it? Well, he's going to have to just stop them, right? I've got control over these switches, so he, he will stop them for me, right? We're not going to have a collision, are we? Getting awfully close. Still got to go over here. Of course, this is the Taft Yard right here, though. Right, I don't have to go down here. This is Pine Lock and Kaylee. Maybe I'm maybe I'm freaking out about nothing. Let's put it, but let's put it in notch two anyway. What I may do here is we're gonna we're gonna pop off of this like this. And we're gonna walk out in front of it. So this is a CTC switch. Yeah, see this switch right here? Hey, how you doing, pal? We gotta throw this one back. Or we gotta throw it to there we go. That's what I thought was going on. To get it to go into the yard here. Then we're gonna run all the way down here while our train is still moving. Probably should just flew down here. Uh, okay, so we're going to go... Yeah, that, that one's fine. This one we're going to throw into normal. There we go. And this one's going to be reversed. And you know what we're going to do? We're going to go all the way down to the bottom track here this time. Last time I put them on these tracks here. I'm going to do that this time. Normal, 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 normal. All righty. We'll run back up. Probably should fly. Let's fly back up. There we go. And then we're going to grab out of this, even though it's doing 15 miles. Not very realistic. But what are you going to do? There we go. I got onto the wrong end of it, but that's the best I could do. Let's take a look at what's going on in the dispatch screen. I think we're going to make it through all right. Now, this one up here is showing that it is set incorrectly. It's, yeah, it's got pink right there. Can't be here, right? Or because this is wrong? I don't know. All right. We'll have to go back over there and set all those uh, manual switches back to mainline service. All right, here we go. Shouldn't be too fast for this, right? We're getting a little bit of sway here when we hit this corner, but should be good, I think. Into Taft Yard we go. Now on the screen, does it actually say Taft Yard? It says TOFC. It says the West Yard. It doesn't say Taft. I mean, here's Taft. So. No, they're calling this the West Yard. Whoops, don't do that. All right. The underpass here. Oh, and I wanted to see too. I didn't even look. Okay, yeah. The run eight one is much farther away than I thought. Run these down. I don't know how, uh, if the whole train's going to fit on this one track or not, but we'll find out.
down to the other end. This yard's uh, big-ish, but in comparison to rice yard, it's tiny. Coming up to the end here. Let's zoom in a little bit. Yeah, we are. We're coming up to the end. There's those engines I had in storage. Let's uh, put it in uh, neutral now. Let's give it a little bit of break. Give me a break. Ready? There we go. What are we looking like here? Is that pretty good? I'm happy with that placement. That's nice. Okay. Let's fly up now to the other end of the yard. Oh, yeah. Oh, gosh. Oh, jeez. <laughs> it's a lot further than I thought. All right. So, uh, next thing we got to do then is, uh, holy guacamole. Uh, we got to cut it right here, right? Uh, let's go back to F12. There we go. And we're going to say, uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, there we go. We are going to, uh, no, no, no. Well, I got to start on that one. Why can I not click on that? There we go. All right. So we're going to set the handbrake and we want to open the angle cock. Am I doing this right now? Yeah, that's right. Then on this side, we just want to close the angle cock. Okay. And then we want to move forward for the disconnect. There we go. Brakes off. Forward. Give me a notch one. Brakes off. Here we go. I can't hit F7 now because it's going to release the brakes. Two. Three. <laughs> Am I fundamentally missing something here? Because if I click on this car, what's it say? Yeah, it says the handbrake is released. Right? Yeah. So why is this? It's closed. And this one should remain open. Well, that's one thing. Let's open it now. Now can I? Now can we go? Because when it disconnects, then it'll drain out of the air out of this this side, and then it'll be it'll be good. But it won't move forward now until I do F seven, and then of course if I do that, it's going to reconnect. Yeah, it's going to reconnect everything. Set the handbrake on that one. And uh, keep the angle cock. Close that one. And now move forward. What the haystacks? It looks like it's moving forward now. No. I, I don't. Oh, because I didn't open the coupler. Man, is that what the problem was? I didn't open a coupler. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. So that, that one closed. I want to open this coupler. Oh, there's too much strain now. I'm a moron. Okay. We'll put it in reverse. Here we go. Open the coupler. Now give me some reverse action here. Here it comes. I can hear it. Okay, now let, let's concentrate this time. All right, so this one here, we're going to leave it open. The handbrake is there. Now uncouple. Okay. Over here, closed. That's right. And then open the coupler. Okay, now we want to put it in forward. And now we want to go. See how this works? Okay, we got some forward action going now. <laughs> I 
here we go. That's how that works. But you know what else works? We are in the butter zone right now, folks. Uh, let's take a look at this train. Okay, we still got some time. Uh, tune in next week. Will I get out of the way of 9689 Run 8, or will there be a collision? Uh, that kind of a cliffhanger thing going on there. Uh, let's uh, let's put on some brake here. It's gone uh, far enough as it is. Uh, and you know what else we're going to do here? Besides end the video, we're going to look at that facility. That's what we're going to do. Here it is. Oh, it was worth every second of it, wasn't it? Look at all the cars over here. They got part. Whoa, whoa. Uh, and I thought there used to be a big building here. Oh, yeah, there is. Oh, no, that's. Oh, this is for uh, that over there. Yeah, we must be, they must just be uh, unloading cars here. That's what these ramps are, and then they just drive them off. So this is like a distribution area. This is not a uh, a factory or whatever. But uh, let, let's uh, let's end the video looking at the facility that I promised you to look at for such a long time. All right, so uh, we will finish uh, in Episode 17. We'll finish uh, putting those uh, cars into the yard, those empty uh, well cars. Uh, and then we'll uh, move on to something else. I don't know what yet. It all depends on where my spreadsheet sends me. Thanks for watching, guys. I had a lot of fun. Wasn't exactly the most exciting episode in the world, but you know what? In my heart, I loved it. And if you guys don't, that's okay. You don't have to. I'm having fun. <laughs> why don't you like? Why don't you subscribe? Why don't you leave me a comment? And if you don't like the fact that it took all the way to the end of the video to look at this wonderful facility... Well, this just may not be the channel for you.